This is the year of the nurse and midwife, marking 200 years since Florence Nightingale was born. Nursing today is very different from in Florence Nightingale's day, and I've been truly inspired by the diversity of skills and opportunities within the profession here at the RUH. Now more than ever, I'm so proud to be a nurse. We've seen our resilience and our skills tested in ways we could never have imagined, and yet we've continued to care with bravery, with courage and with empathy in face of the unknown. I was a bit anxious at first when the pandemic hit and we, we kind of thought we could see this monster coming over the hill. We didn't quite know what to expect. We didn't know how many cases we were going to have, if we were going to have any at all. Personally, I've just taken it day by day, settled into it, decided just to come to work and do my best on that day and take it as it comes. And I think everyone's done that. And as the weeks and days have gone by, we've just you know kind of it's become part of it of our everyday work and providing the best service we can in, in, in pretty difficult times. So our ward here is uh, primarily diabetic and endocrine medicine but recently we've had to change our practices in light of, uh, of Covid. It's been an interesting time, uh, it's been many challenges and, and what has been wonderful to see is how the team have changed and developed over that period of time and they've they make me very proud um, they've been very adaptable and, you know, yes, people have COVID, but they still have other illnesses too, so it's really important that we look after them from a holistic point of view. As a nurse, you should expect for the worst. You should expect for different cases. At first, when COVID came, I came here with a little bit fear, but the compassion and the uh, a uh, passion to, to be with the patient, to, to touch their lives, to have a big difference with it. That's more important than the COVID, I think. <laughs> I'm becoming emotional. Working on the front line during all of this and doing all of the training um, in a, the team that I have has been hugely challenging. It's been difficult, I won't deny that. It's been amazing. I've met such amazing people and they have really made it a joy to come in such a stressful time. The best moment is definitely when we clap a patient out. Um, because they've, they've got better and we've, we've beaten it. So yeah, that's probably the best moment. I'm sorry we're not able to celebrate this special milestone in the exciting ways that we'd planned for and hoped for. So for now, let me say a huge thank you to all our midwives and our nurses who are making a difference. I'm sure all the nurses and midwives that have blazed a trail ahead of us would be as proud as I am today of all of you.